Hi everybody, this is Anna Chaos for another Anna Chaos product review. And today I bring to you guys the Epic Bars. Epic Bars. Epic Bars. Alright, now these things are awesome. Um, I've been finding them at the gas station down the street from my office and I like to try them at first you know I've seen the brand before online and I'm just like oh what is that that looks kind of good and it's actually in the gas station so I started with the chicken sriracha and at the time I was an idiot and all I read was chicken I didn't bother to read the red strike that said sriracha on it so yeah I am not much of a, a spicy person yes I am a Hispanic female that doesn't like like spicy food you know how much of a weirdo I am in my community exactly so yeah, so it was pretty odd. However, it was very tasty. Uh, if you like sriracha, you would definitely love this. And then this is actually a very clean product. You should go online and check out their stats. Let me see if I can get the camera to focus a little bit. Focus, focus. Of course you're not gonna focus. All right, well, I'm gonna go ahead and read it out to you. So this has saved me several times from <laughs> I'll go to the office and someone brings donuts or bagels or whatever the situation is. And so I make sure that I at least try to have one of these on me all the time or some form of like beef jerky so that when I see they're picking out on whatever the dessert they brought in for the day. And to be fair, the last couple of weeks I've been bad, but that's mainly because again, I'm letting my body rest. I'm letting my leg heal. I'm letting a lot of different things heal. I've had a lot of stuff happen to me back to back in the last two months. And I'm just now recovering after two months later. So after after this point, everything's pretty nice and chill and I'm just pretty stoked. But anyway, so let me tell you a little about these. Um, the, the ingredients of this actually are pretty clean. Uh, it says in the back, it says natural chicken. This was so the chicken one. Sea salt, red pepper, flake, lactic acid. That's because, you know, it has to be able to be preserved. Organic chai seed, garlic, paprika, onion, celery powder, red pepper, black pepper, cumin, and uh, oregano. That is pretty clean for a bar, uh, especially for beef jerky. I mean, the only thing on there is lactic acid that's to be able to preserve the product. As for the macros on this, uh, for one small bar, which is 43 grams, yes, the bar's only that big, and sorry guys, I already ate it, it was delicious. Uh, it is per 100 calories. Uh, fats is 35 calories, total fats is 4 grams, cholesterol 25 milligrams, sodium 290, which is not bad for something like this, it's the equivalent of beef jerky, total carbs is just 1, protein is 15, 15 grams of protein for 2 ounces of chicken with sriracha on it, that is not bad at all, so this one, is, it was pretty decent for me, um, the next one was the bison, and this one was pretty interesting because I believe they put cranberries on it. And I need to find out, someone told me that it's kind of like a Native American thing. And I, I don't know anything about Native American culture, so I, I'm going to excuse my naivety. But the meat itself was great. I didn't care for the cranberries in the meat because I don't like to eat sweet meat. So that's just a personal taste, not something that, that the product is bad. It's just my preference. I don't like sweet meat. And when I was eating this... I didn't realize it said uncured bacon cranberry. Okay, so again, that kind of that kind of sucked for me, where I'm just kind of like, oh, it has cranberries, and you know, kind of pissed me off because all I see is bison. You know, I'm being your standard consumer. I see whatever the largest word is, and then I see the flavor after the fact that I ate it. So that totally sucks. So. People from Epic, if you're reading this, can you make sure that you put the flavor in that, you know, like empty space we got going on here? So that way, you know, and I know that's kind of like the look, trying to keep it nice and clean, but seriously, the flavor right there for people that are derp derp like me, because I get up at 4 a.m. in the morning and I'm at the gas station at 6 picking up the freaking, you know, protein bar or a little snack bar, and I'm just reading bison. That's all my brain sees, protein, protein, protein. I'm not reading the flavor. So, you know, that's it. That's my only complaint. But this one, again, it's not bad. The caloric uh, amount on this is 140 calories. Uh, fats is 8 grams. Cholesterol is 25 milligrams. Sodium, 250 milligrams. Total carbs is 10 grams, because remember, there are cranberries in it. Cranberries are a carb, so it's going to add the sugar to it. And then you have 8 grams of protein. So a lot less than the chicken one, but it was, for what it was, it was tasty. I'm not going to lie. The ingredients on it is bison, uncured bacon, 
no nitrite or nitrate acid. They did not add it to this. So pork, water, brown sugar, salt, vinegar, celery, powdered sea salt, dried cranberries, cranberries, apple juice, concentrate, lactic acid, celery powder, and sea salt. Again, not bad. Pretty clean. Of course, it has a couple items in there that are not natural, but again, you're talking about a product that has to be able to stay on the shelves for a little while. So those of you guys who are like super naturalists, you're not going to be buying this anyway, so who cares? Okay, so that's not bad. And then the last one was the pulled pork one. Now this one I like because I immediately saw pulled pork. No hidden extra band right here or here. Pulled pork. Pulled pork. That worked excellent for me. So I really like this one. Um, it wasn't bad. Um, and it's right up my alley. It wasn't spicy. It was great. Obviously, if you don't eat pork, then you definitely don't want to come near this. Uh, the calories on this are 100 calories, total fat is 6 grams, cholesterol 30, sodium 210, total carbs is 2, which is pretty good, protein is 8 grams, and the ingredients on this is natural pork, lactic acid, dehydrated garlic, celery powder, sea salt, paprika, cumin, onion, black pepper, cilantro, and I believe it says grigano. I must apologize, this has some plastic on it, so it's kind of hard to read. Um, but yeah, this, these parts are actually pretty good and the pricing that I found at the gas station is about, about $2 a bar, which is not bad. And like I said, it has saved me several times from picking out and eating whatever people brought into the office. So all in all, this is pretty good. I am not going to complain. All right. So my winner for me, uh, will be pulled pork because you know, just a Puerto Rican, Puerto Rican, we love our pork, chuletas, penin. Delicious, so pulled pork was number one. And then we got the Epic Bar, but it's Sriracha, so I gotta be careful because it's spicy. My tummy doesn't agree with it. And at the bottom, just because of the cranberries for me, the bison. So I haven't found any other more flavors. I'll keep an eye for any other more flavors in the future, but all in all, it's a fantastic product, and I definitely look forward to trying more of their products in the future. But anyway, guys, this has been Anna Chaos for another Anna Chaos product review. Please don't forget to find me on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest, Tumblr. I'm also on bodybuilder.com, Fitbit, and MyFitnessPal. Uh, don't be shy to send me a friend request on those. I have absolutely no problem. And don't forget to check out my GoFundMe. If you cannot donate towards my cause, at least share my story. That's all that I ask. Anyway, talk to you guys soon. Bye-bye.